here with the beautiful, talented Miley Cyrus, March 5th. You're going to see her on Saturday Night Live, which kind of cracks me up because you know they do the Miley, Miley show. Show, which, I, which is pretty cool. It's one of my favorite skits that they do. So Come on, do you it. really like it? Yes, it's hilarious. Okay, so when you go on, I would. I don't want to see you host. I want to see you going against your Miley. I would love that. I don't know if they're going to have me do something like that, but I think it would be so funny. I, I started watching them. Kelly Osborne actually showed it to me. She's like, have you seen the Miley Cyrus show? I said, no. She showed it to me. I'm obsessed with it. I think it's so funny. So. Now, I also heard a little rumor that you are interested in doing the prequel to Sex and the City, where you would play the young Someone Carrie. Someone asked me if I was doing that, and I said, no, that would be cool. But as you can tell on the Miley Cyrus show, I say everything would be cool. Everything is really cool. Uh, it's in my book. So, you know, it would be, but I'm not doing that right now. But, but I mean, kind of, if they, such an iconic role to take over, if you had the chance, what would woman wouldn't? I would think about it. I would just do it for the clothes. What is cool is your new tattoo, new Dreamcatcher tattoo. Yes, you can kind of see it tonight. It's kinda kind of sort of hidden with this stuff but yeah I love dream catchers it's something that meant a lot to me because it was the dream catcher that I had above my bed since I was a kid and it's all of um, my brothers and sisters are what the feathers represent and so something that means something to me always good seeing you always good talking to you good to see you too before you watch Oscar on ABC watch TV Guide Network for Academy Awards red carpet with Chris Harrison Sunday February 27th 6 Eastern 3 Pacific